Sister Wives, Robin's slump plays out in her posts, and McKelty Brown slams rumors she split from husband Tony Padron. Stop assuming. I will explain everything. Watch this video until end. Hey lovely viewers, welcome to my 2S gossip channel. Sister Wives star Robin Brown's distance from viewers of the TLC series started years ago when she went dark on social media due to backlash. But her posts read like a road map that leads into darkness for this reality celerity. Robin Brown's co-wives have their social media pages filled with photos of all the Sister Wives kids. Through the years, they've shared many pictures of the Brown siblings and half-siblings in photos. Robin posted a few pictures of family gatherings and special occasions. But fans suggested over the years that most of her posts read like a family of only two parents and five kids, Robin's kids. This tendency started long before she rolled up the sidewalks for good by stopping her social media posts. For the fans, this became one of the reasons she collected so much backlash in the comment sections of her posts. Robin rewrites history. Then there was the gift that Robin Brown presented to Cody Brown. Sister Wives fans immediately hopped online to tag this portrait as, creepy. Again, it was all about her kids and Cody. But fans saw a big problem with this. The portrait, seen above, has Cody with Robin's three kids as toddlers and babies. Cody didn't know Robin, Brown or her kids when they were that age. It seems she used a picture of him with his biological kids. But the artist painted her three children from her first marriage, who Cody adopted, in place of his other kids. Sister Wives. Fans pick a post, any post. Looking back at Robin's post from years ago, it's easy to see fans have a one-track mind regarding the fourth wife of the Sister Wives family. Even in the most cheery posts the show's fans left awful comments. In one from, several years back, she talks about strong women. So, this was meant to be an uplifting message, but fans jumped on the comments section suggesting she get a job. That went along with more bashing as well. Many of the negative comments had nothing to do with the post they were left on. But it seems like the Sister Wives fans took advantage of any place they could find to get a message across to Robin Brown. Robin unplugs. Robin Brown finally stopped posting, likely because each post became a platform to slam her some more. But the way she used social media for all those years, added fuel for the Sister Wives fans. With all those posts about her, her kids and Cody, it seemed to the viewers of the show that she was monopolizing Cody's time. Still, it wasn't until the last few seasons that her co-wives finally said on camera that Cody favored Robin. This validated what the fans had been saying for years. So, with Robin unplugged from the online world, there's nothing new from her where fans can comment. But Sister Wives fans are creative, and it seems like a new comment gets added to Robin's old posts almost daily. The recent family tragedy seemed to draw fans to her old posts. So, the viewers from the TLC series seem to find a way to get their word across to Robin Brown, one way or the other. Sister Wives star McKelty Brown has a message for fans regarding her current relationship status with her husband, Tony Padron. I'm still married people. McKelty, 27, wrote via her Instagram stories on Sunday, March 24 alongside a photo of her and her husband enjoying lunch together. Stop assuming just because he's not in every single post that he's not mine. McKelty's message came after fans noticed Tony, 29, hadn't appeared in any of her social media uploads since Valentine's Day. The mom of three quickly cleared up the confusion and reiterated she and her husband of seven years were still going strong. In the last few weeks, McKelty focused on her children as she mourned the death of her half-brother, Robert Garrison Brown, and was grateful for the merriment they added to her life during the tough time. I appreciate the light and happiness this kid of mine brings to every day of my life, she wrote on March 12th alongside a photo of her daughter, Avalon, smiling. What a blessing to have her around. To have her for comfort and for all the hugs. Garrison, who was the 25-year-old son of Janelle Brown and Cody Brown, died from a self-inflicted gunshot wound, police confirmed to in touch on March 5th. Just hours after the news broke about his passing, Janelle, 54, and Cody, 55, confirmed his death in a joint Instagram post. 
Cody and I are deeply saddened to announce the loss of our beautiful boy Robert Garrison Brown. The exes, who were married from 1993 to 2022, wrote in a lengthy caption. He was a bright spot in the lives of all who knew him. His loss will leave such a big hole in our lives that it takes our breath away. We ask that you please respect our privacy and join us in honoring his memory. Taking time away to grasp the loss of her half-brother, McKelty shared a touching tribute dedicated to the former soldier on March 11th. My heart breaks for my brother who's no longer with us but it rejoices knowing he's with his fellow warriors in Valhalla drinking and fighting with Odin, McKelty alongside a photo of Garrison smiling. Next to her daughter, Avalon, I hope he is loving his place amongst the stars. Garrison was always the funniest person in the room. He was one cool dude. McKelty concluded that it especially hurts that her kids will never be able to experience his fun presence, but added, he will live on in all my family's memories. Have fun up with the star's little bro, you're missed. Before Garrison Brown's tragic death, he had been struggling with his mental health and addiction. He was having a hard time before his death. The reality TV world was shaken this month by the tragic, untimely death of 25-year-old Sister Wives star Garrison Brown, who had been struggling with some personal issues before his passing. Garrison was found dead in his flagstaff, Arizona, home with a self-inflicted gunshot wound. He was found by his younger brother, Gabriel Brown, who had volunteered to check in on him. The young National Guard member and student leaves behind his father, four mothers, and 17 brothers and sisters. When Sister Wives first premiered in 2010, the large Brown family lived in one large house in Utah, with all the siblings growing up together. This was when the family was at its happiest, including Garrison. After Cody married his fourth wife, Robin Brown, and moved his family out of Utah, the family began to crumble. Making matters worse, the arrival of the COVID-19 pandemic further divided the family. By 2023, three of Cody's four wives have left him, and many of his children rarely see him anymore. According to E! News, Garrison's mother, Janelle Brown, told police that her son had sent a text before he died that read, I want to hate you for sharing the good times. But I can't. I miss these days. There's been a lot of online speculation about what this message could have meant. It's possible the message was referencing the good days when his family was still together. Ever since Cody married his favorite wife, Robin, during Sister Wives Season 1, he spent less and less time with his older children, and Garrison has felt resentful because of it. Addison stated that he has had conversations with Garrison about him being depressed lately. He stated that Garrison is an alcoholic and drinks every night. According to The Sun, which obtained a copy of the police report, Garrison's roommates told police he had a serious drinking problem and that he drank on most nights, and he appeared to be intoxicated the night he passed away. The roommates, identified as Addison, Cheyenne, and Tyler, also told police that the Sister Wives star had spoken to all three of them about his struggles with depression. The officer wrote, Addison stated that he has had conversations with Garrison about him being depressed lately. The report went on to say, he stated that Garrison is an alcoholic and drinks every night. According to the same police report, all three of Garrison's Roommates also told officers that the Sister Wives star and National Guard member told him that he had been having issues with one of his ex-girlfriends. The report went on to say that Addison stated that he knew that Garrison was having problems with his ex-girlfriend and that he was not a very happy person. Cheyenne corroborated Addison's claim. She stated that she talked a little more in depth with him about how he was struggling with drinking and his depression surrounding. That, the police statement read, and I don't think we do enough to bring awareness. It wasn't bullying. It wasn't a lack of love that Garrison had. It was mental health. And I am going to continue talking about mental health and self-care until I am blue in the face. In an Instagram post following Garrison's death, his sister, Madison Brown revealed that social media pressure may have contributed to her brother's feelings of inadequacy. Madison believed Garrison's struggles were exacerbated by social media, which made him feel like he wasn't doing enough. Despite all he accomplished, he never felt good enough. And I don't think we do enough to bring awareness. It wasn't bullying. 
It wasn't a lack of love that Garrison had, it was mental health, Madison said. And I am going to continue talking about mental health and self-care until I am blue in the face, she added. Two weeks ago, on Tuesday March 5th, my older brother Garrison took his own life. He was 25, I'm having a hard time understanding it. But I know now, more than anything, that my brother Garrison is no longer in any more pain. Several of Garrison's siblings have addressed the sister wives star's mental health before his tragic death. On March 18, Garrison's sister, Savannah Brown, posted several photos of her brother to Instagram, including a photo of a young Garrison holding baby Savannah during happier times for the Brown family. Her caption read, Two weeks ago, on Tuesday March 5th, my older brother Garrison took his own life. He was 25. I'm having a hard time understanding it. She went on to say, but I know now, more than anything, that my brother Garrison is no longer in any more pain. The shock over the tragic death of Garrison Brown continues to reverberate through the Sister Wives universe, and Robin Brown will never be the same. When the series first premiered in 2010, Cody was married to his first three wives, Mary Brown, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown. Cody, his three wives, and their 12 children all lived in one large house in Utah, with each wife having her own wing where she lived with her children. Everything changed when Cody moved the Brown family out of Utah and to Arizona, in fear that the state would prosecute him for polygamy. Thanks for watching this video. What do you think about this video told on comment box and subscribe your channel.